Welcome to ISTL TV studios. I'm Lauren White. Joining me today is Greg Daly, the correct collector of revenue for the city of St. Louis. Greg, thank you very much for joining us Thanks, today. Thanks, Lauren. Pleasure to be here. It's that time of year again, uh, December sure the 31st, is. It and sure is. you're here to remind folks of what they have to do by that date. I am, and thanks for the opportunity to be here. Uh, as the collector of revenue, it is my responsibility to uh, collect your personal property and your real estate taxes on a yearly basis. And this year they're due as of every other year on December the 31st. Uh, so far things are going extremely well. We're, uh, the collections are coming in rather, uh, rather, rather quickly and uh, things are going pretty good so far. And one thing you've done this year is you've really helped to expedite this by making people available to pay 24 seven with a visa or debit card. Lauren, that's true. I, I think at, uh, when you're in the business of collecting taxes, uh, you have to be there when people are thinking about it. And if somebody's thinking about paying their taxes at two o'clock in the morning, then there has to be some kind of a road and some kind of a way to make sure that if you're gonna pay them and you're thinking about doing it then, then we need to have the access for it. And, and that's what we're trying to do is making it as, as easy as possible to collect your taxes. Okay, now there have been some changes as far as the penalties and interest are concerned this year and to bring us more in line with the rest of the communities in Missouri. There has. Uh, last year, the uh, Missouri legislature passed a bill to make St. Louis, uh, make St. Louis, St. Louis City in conjunction with the other 114 counties in the state of Missouri. What that, what that means is that every, every month there will be a 2% interest and penalty uh, laid on late taxes with a cap of 18%. Uh, it does, you know, it's different from what it has been in the past. Mm -hmm. Most importantly, we're asking people to pay their taxes on time. Okay, very good. And I want to make sure that people know that the, the de uh, December the 31st and December the 24th, City Hall is closed because you can always go down there and pay your taxes at your office in person, but they will be closed on December the 24th and December the 31st. Also, there is uh, five area places that you can go to in the city of St. Louis. We'll put a graphic up to show you those areas right there in the Bank of America, PNC and M&I Bank. Those are also five additional locations you can go to to pay your taxes. Isn't that right, Greg? Yes. Uh, <laughs> the, the whole idea here, again, Lauren, is to make it as convenient as possible. And we're at City Hall Monday through Friday from 8 in the morning till 5. We're located in room 110, first floor of City Hall. I would very much suggest that anybody who uh, wants to come down and pay their taxes, come down before the last day. It does. It's like anything else. It gets very crowded, very cumbersome on the last day uh, of paying your taxes. But again, the five area banks that are located throughout the city of St. Louis are there for the taxpayer's convenience. Again, if you want to pay online, that's also there at, for your convenience. And one other thing I want to remind people, you can still go down to your office and get your driver's license and your plates and tags. And that, that's really a convenient stop because if you're downtown, you can get right, get it everything really, right and there. And Lauren, thanks for bringing that up. Uh, we, uh, we also have a, a state fee office. And in a lot of cases, some people need to get a birth certificate or they need to get something or a waiver from the assessor's office. All this information is located at City Hall. When you receive that information, you can walk over to our office, get your plates, get your, uh, get your tags, and be ready to go. So it's, uh, it really is kind of a one-stop shop thing and has really worked over the years. Uh, and something that you have been kind enough to let me come on to the show previous to this, uh, we offer the, uh, the, the wheel locks. And, uh, and those are now, I think they're uh, $5. So they're cheaper at our place than any place else. We also offer the plastic uh, shields for your covers because right. uh, there has been a, a problem with uh, taking the tags off and things like that. So we offer those things at a reduced price. And, and actually our fee office is working out extremely well for everybody involved. Greg, you're doing a great job there. You brought a lot of technological advances. You're making it easier for people to pay their bills. We're just about out of time. Anything else you'd like to add? Lauren, thanks again for having me. Uh, always appreciate being down here. And if I could, I'd just like to take the opportunity to wish the, the citizens of the city of St. Louis a happy holiday. And uh, we're doing our best to make sure that, that t their tax dollars are being directed in the uh, right direction. That's one other thing, I, just before we go, when people pay their taxes, that allows the city to provide the services that they provide for Very us. much so. Uh, we're, we're like any other business. Uh, it's, a, it's a matter of cash flow, and it's very important that people pay their taxes on time. Uh, the, there is a 21% 
that comes into the city of St. Louis that goes directly into general revenue and, and everybody sees that uh, with regards to streets, trash, this kind of thing. So it's, it's very important. Greg, thank you very much for coming Thanks, in. Thanks, Lauren. I very much appreciate the opportunity. All righty, Greg Daly, the Collector of Revenue here. I'm Lauren Watt. We want you to keep watching STL TV and experience St. Louis.